<laughs> We're making a good start today. For now, I'll probably rate the, the, that girl an 83. Uh... Sherazard? Mm-hmm. That he is. Or so it seems. Uh, wait. You there! Did he say he's Lucius Bright? taking your first step as bracers. Your names are already being mentioned among the customers. R really? Roland may be in the country, but we've got some famous people here, like Cassius and Cheryl. Now I just wonder how you're going to break into the big leagues. Oh, come on, Alyssa. Please don't put so much pressure on me. The, ch the chef suddenly says something about changing his supplier. I wonder what's going on. Uh, maybe his supplier has changed, but his menu has not. Even though she's just being fictitious, she's still completely right about Roland's resources. She has a very good kind for, very good eye for all kind of commodities. We certainly were lucky this time. Who'd have thought that discovering? Yeah, I've already. I've definitely already. Oh, worthless talk of merchants from the. Hmm. I feel like I've read that before. Anyway, we received a message from the Purzel Farm saying they wouldn't be able to ship vegetables for a while. I wonder what could have happened to the farm. I guess I'll have to make immediate arrangements with another supplier. Unbelievable! I came all the way here just to find that I was wasted all this time for nothing. I can't find any buyers, and the shops are bigger cheapskates than I thought they'd be. I guess it's safe to say that the backwater places will always be backwater places. Hmm. Wow. Halvard? Sounds familiar. Is there some famous store or something? The Chalvard Republic is the country to the east of the Liberal. The one, the border closest to this town, also. Calvard main folk craft items are what you're selling, eh? I'm sure you'll find a lot more people willing to take up off your hands if you went to the royal city. Ah, uh, you think so? I really thought some place in the boonies like this one would be a taker of these, but maybe I was wrong. <laughs> oh well, I guess I'll try heading for Gressel sooner rather than later. Then again, what is my son Charles up to? Just when I thought I could get some help out of him, he up and wanders off. Hmm. Where did Cassius take off to? That's so. Uh, Cassius was the one who I was most focused on. That's too bad. Claire. I think that even if Cassius dresses in normal attire, he'd still shine as an adult male. By changing his style, he'd express himself as a characteristic view, aside from the typical gel. There's no doubt he'd be popular on a whole new level, too! Um... I'm not sure how comfortable I am with you talking like that about my dad. <laughs> ah, crap. I wonder where the darn thing went. I've checked every place I could think of. I don't want to go in here yet. I 
I was just thinking about this as I was out shopping, but it seems like there's a whole lot less quality of vegetables now than there used to be. I wonder if it's just my imagination. If my lower back hadn't given me all this trouble, I'd still be working in the forest. It's too bad that my body aches as bad as it does at this age. I still want to be out there and working. I feel a bit insecure about my daughter's husband working out there alone. Have you ever heard of anything from your father about when he was in the military? Hmm. Interesting. He's often told me about my mom, though. How about you, Joshua? Have you heard anything from Dad? Even if I ask, he always finds some way to evade the subject. Yeah, he does that, doesn't he? I see. At any rate, Liberal is at peace. And there's nothing I want more than to have Yumi live in a time of peace. So I just realized that this is actually... Excuse me, that this is actually a guy. He has a mustache. Uh, because I thought for sure that that, that was Yumi's mother? But no. I guess it's Yumi's father. <laughs> Looks like the airliner bound for the Royal City from Bose has arrived. But since we've got nothing coming in, we'll be able to focus here on the shop. the deal of everything being so short supply around here? Damn it! Somehow I'm going to have to dig up a great A product before I have my next business deal. Head to the next one. Rather. Reno is a hard worker and a good son. But as a parent, I'd like him to take a wife and set, set my mind at ease. Looks like Lynn just arrived in the landing airport. I'm sure the products I ordered from Buzz have come, so I've got to go pick them up. Mm. Oh, interesting. Let's see. I don't have my issue of the news anymore. Uh, I've already read this, so I guess I don't need to buy a new one. Don't particularly feel the need to go down there. Please bless the mayor and his wife so that they may live in good health. Estelle and Joshua, I heard that you both joined the guild. I am sure that aside from your aspirations and expectations, that, uh, no, I've, uh, the absence of a parent would cause anyone to feel uncertain. However, we as humans have the strength to overcome such adversity. Think of these trials as a gift from the goddess, and work hard to overcome them. I've heard many things about you from Father Divide. I noticed he did not say many good things. Again, I noticed you did not say many good things. <laughs> it seems that Estelle is likable, despite being an atrocious student. There and Roland feels so fresh, and the city itself is peaceful and calm. Oh, interesting. Still back here, I see. Our son is working as a teacher at the Genesis Royal Academy. 
the house has felt quite spacious since he left. But at times like these, when I feel a little lonely. I heard a new load. Iode? A new iode was discovered in the Malgam Mines to the north of here. And it seems that it's a pretty promising deposit as well. This is definitely good news for the mine. Neat. Let's see. Things have just settled down here from at the front desk. We had a lot of guests coming in and out of here when the airliners are landing and departing. No one in here. No one in here. Oh, but she is still here. Appointment with the mayor. I see. I see. I wonder if she's a student of the mayor's son. Because she is wearing a uniform. And the first thing I think of that is a, a school. But admittedly, she, it could be a military uniform. Let's see, how about I get to work on my inspections and maintenance? This tower is the symbol of Roland. It's history, and it's my pride and joy! Right, well, I think that's just about everything. Yep. Well, back in the day, Cassius used to leave a spell with us while he was away. But after you came here, he started having you keep an eye on things. I still got surprisingly lonely when no one was around. Whenever we had her over, she was as quiet as a cat among strangers. <laughs> Certainly not now. That's kind of sweet. How are you two doing today? Cassius is gone for a while, right? If you need anything, please know you're welcome to come and ask for help. We're not strangers or new acquaintances, you know? Don't hesitate if you need anything, or I'll be angry. Right. Okay. On that note, we can head in here. And, uh... Hmm... Okay. I think I'm gonna take a short break here. I, I need to fill up my various beverages and also take a... And also stretch my legs, really. <laughs> so uh, I will be back in maybe five minutes. Or longer, depending on whether you are watching this live or not. Uh, in any case, I'll see you in a few.